We're going to do 10 Karoks, starting on Davdi Davdi Island, and then we're going to go around Ulria Grotto in Lanarayu. So, starting on this island, looks like there's one over here. What is this one? Um, right by it. Why don't I see anything? Oh, it's these lily pads. Okay. Let's take care of these octorocks. Can I shoot them in the water? I think I can. Yeah, sweet. That's nice. You don't have to wait for them to pop out if you don't want to. So let's jump in here. And there's Karok number one. 81. Awesome. Okay. Now let's do Karok number two. It looks like it's on the smaller island. And it is nice and sunny, so we could probably climb up here and float over there, maybe. Ooh, a nice hardy radish. Three of them. Big hardy radishes. Ooh, those are good. Okay, make a mental note right there. Three hardy radishes. Cooked by itself, it definitely uh, heals all of your hearts and then increases your heart capacity, which is really nice. A broken rock with a Karok inside. Yeah, uh -huh, you found me. 82. So now, let's teleport to the grotto and then we'll go south from there. There are a few games that have a map like this that play hide-and-seek with different ways, and I think it is just so fun. Oh, it's raining! Oh, this is going to be bad. How am I going to get up? Oh, that's not good. Oh, it's slippery. It's slippery. Oh, there's air over here. Perfect! Okay, that was completely lucky. Oh, thank you, air. This gold one. Is up at the top of this? Oh, slippery. Okay. Ooh, not too bad. Only one or two slips there. Where's the easiest way to get up here? Okay. I don't know if there's any like easier geographical place to get up to the top of this. Oh! Oh, that felt good, but. Wait, is it stopped raining? No, it's still raining. Okay. It looks like it might be a little bit less steep over here. Shallower over here. If I can get to that little ridge. Yeah, that one. Right there. Right there. Yep, right there. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. You can do this. The rain. My worst enemy. Give me a Lionel first. Oh, it's so slippery. Okay, we're going to replenish. And I was there anyway. Oh, it's just that last little bit. Oh, it's just a, a light, uh, light motes. Awesome. Yeah, ha, ha, you found me. Wow. Okay, green and then purple. Definitely green and then purple. What is this? Why are there rocks here? Why are there rocks here? Are these magnetic rocks? They are. Why do we have magnetic rocks right there? Why are there so many magnetic rocks right there? Uh, is that a Karok? There are so many rocks on both sides. I don't know what that's about. It kind of tells me like Karok, but maybe not. Maybe I missed one on my map marker. We might come back to that. So there's something in the trees here. Do I need to climb a tree? Do I need to climb this big tree? I sure hope not. I feel like it was right in the dead center of that big tree, though. With it raining. Is it ever going to stop raining because I'm near Zora domain? Let's see if we can climb this rock. Based on that last experience of climbing, I'm not eager to repeat the experience. Let's mark it on the map. See if we can 
approach this rock from any other easier angle. Yeah, what about over here? I just need the rain to let up, like, for five minutes. Can it just, like... It's clear skies! Oh, I need to do this. I mean, it has to be on top of the tree, right? Ooh, this is going to be brutal. I am gaining ground. Things I do for Kuroks. Okay. Oh, it is on the top of the tree. It is. And I think we can make it. Nope. Oh, come on. There we go. Wow. I can't believe we did that in the rain. Definitely would be easier to do this when it's not raining. Now there's one over here. Mm, don't see it. Is it on this tree? Nope. Okay, it's not on the tree. There. We have to somehow hit this off, and then it's underneath. Second up. Sweet. Two hits is plenty. Yeah, ha You found me. 85. Now five more. Let's do this one. Hopefully we can get away from this Zora Domain business. And we'll hit up the Fairy Fountain as well. Starting with blue. Blue or red. Maybe red and then blue and then we'll circle back. Oh, how do we get... Whoa! Landslide. Where do those come from? That's crazy. Uh, is it going to be on the other end of this tunnel? Or do we have to get on top of this tunnel? I don't know. Let's look inside first. Well, it's not raining in here. We could spend the time, but the problem with Zora's Domain still being active is I don't think any amount of time spent is going to stop the rain. Oh, there it is! It's up there. I see it. A little pinwheel. And we need to get up there, use our bone arrow and the arrows we purchased. I'm looking for an easier way to climb than just straight up. This looks better. Approach it from an easier angle. Yeah. Up here, perfect. Uh, oh, right there, okay. Oh, I see it right there, okay, oh. Oh. Okay, now plenty of other ones. Oh, there's one farther. Let's get one of our falcon bows. Oh, okay, a little higher maybe. How about that? Sweet, and then there's one here. Come on. Nice. Oh, there are more than three? Oh, just three. Just three. Okay. I thought that for some reason there were more than three there. The delay was real. Okay. Blue. 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 On my way to blue. The Kuroks are so cute. I, I don't. I really would like a full set of Kurok plush toys. Do they sell Kurok plush toys? Because they absolutely should. Looks like we have some fun bacoblins. Not really interested in fighting them. I'm more interested in getting this Kurok. It is raining, but I found a nice place up this hill. Okay, so we need to make the apples match. Let's make sure we're not being followed anymore. Okay, we're good. One apple on the top. Lots of apples. One apple on the top with a lizard. Okay, so we need to take all the apples off this middle tree to make it match. Oh, I didn't realize it was raining, so we're not going to climb that thing. So we want to keep that one. Shoot the others. So that this middle tree matches the other two trees. And that's how you 
get these pattern trees to ropes. If you've ever seen something super perfectly lined up and something's just a little bit off, then if you make the one thing that's just a little bit off match everything else, then you can usually get a croak. Let's see if we can... Should I knock him off? Great. It's okay. Thank you for the problems. Uh, oh, don't hit me. Whoa, that's not good. Phew. Wow, if he didn't take the time to taunt me, he definitely would have hit me. You're just borrowing your horse. You can it over here by the Kuroke. Really convenient that they have these here. And it's already trained. Let's go use the... Um, do they see me? Oh, they definitely saw me. Let's use this bridge that we see on the map. Oh, oh! We're just close enough that we're going to just jump off here. Yeah. Okay, so these the goblins here usually have special types of arrows, like bomb arrows, electric arrows. Do not take them lightly. Drill shaft. No, not bad. Hmm. I'm worried about that green one. What is that green Karok going to be? Let's go forward with the gold, and then we'll come back to green. What? A Lazalfos? What is he supposed to be doing with this? And what weapon is that? What weapon does he have? Is that a Lino weapon? I don't think I've ever seen a weapon like that. Can I take a picture of? Oh, is he going to jump out? I, I kind of want to take his weapon. Oh, he is going to jump out. And he's going to hurt me really bad. Okay. I just want your weapon, actually. Can you drop it so I can take a picture of it? Or hit me again, I guess. That's two for two. Let's see. Can you? Is it three strikes and I out? Okay, give me the weapon. What is it? Oh, it's like a regular Lionel Spear. I don't think I've ever seen that before. I've seen the Savage Lionel Spear. Stone Smasher, that's good too. Okay, we're, we're to the Karok little part of the map here. Oh, where is it? Oh, I think I see it underneath the bridge. Perfect. West Sakala Bridge. Yeah, ha, ha, you found me. Now, is that uh, the Zolfos still fighting me? I don't know if he lost an interest in me or not. I think he's confused. How do I get back on there, he says. Oh, man. Hello, I'm right here. I guess. Probably should have killed it earlier. Oh, all of the drops in the water. And the lizard runs away too. That's unfortunate. Ooh, some bees. I got the bee honey though. Run away! Run from the bees! Ooh, okay, so this is going to be a pillar of rocks. So where are we throwing them from? Up here. Are the bees still following us? No. Okay. So we don't have a lot of tries that I can see. Three. Oh, we have a few. We have a few extra that are hidden in the grass. Let's first look down. Uh, this doesn't look too bad. It's not super far away. Let's see. Right before the orange. Oh, yeah. I think we can do this without any ice. Let's try again. Right there. Oh, nothing but net. That's a swish. It's a splish. A swoosh? A sploosh. How about that? If you don't hit any of the pillars, it's a sploosh. The equivalent of a swish in basketball. So let's teleport here. We'll drop down to the Great Fairy Fountain uh, and get this last Karoke of Ten. What? Is this Karok going to be? This Karok's right by the Great Fairy Fountain. I should be able to get there pretty quickly. I think I've seen this one before, but I just avoided it. 
I was saving it for this video. But we're hitting it now. Yeah. So this is really cool. So when you have multiple flowers like this, you just do them in order. So one flower, two flower, three flower, four flower, unequip, metallic. Okay, we're good now. Now we need to find the fifth flower. I don't know where the fifth flower is. Oh, it's up there, up on here. So the fifth flower is right here. And then once you get all five of the clumps of flower from one to five in numerical order, then you'll get the crook. Bye-bye.